I think we both would say that we believe that spirituality is a very important part of everybody's life, whether it, if you, you not necessarily if you're a church goer or whether you have a particular faith, but spirituality is a connection um, on a deeper level in life. And even just the surroundings here provide a beautiful um, environment to feel connected um, to nature and, uh, and to a higher power, whatever you perceive him to be. In our case, we both believe in, in God and um, it has really, for me personally, I'll, Barbara will speak herself, but it's really enhanced my, um, yeah, my, uh, my connection to God. I've had some truly precious moments where I have understood on a deeper level um, just by being here and being in this in nurturing environment um, and I, yeah, I, I think this will be something I will never forget. It's been very powerful. I think one of the greatest things is that um, if someone's looking for God, I think, they, I think they look around them and think, well, are people here for me? Are we being loved? Are we being accepted? Are we being made to feel comfortable? And, and I think that when we do feel that way, I feel that God is working within those people around us. And I think this is what's happened this weekend. Mm. Yeah, um, the people, the staff here at Shalem uh, lead by example. There's no pressure, um, but just by their, um, the way that their intrinsic way of living their lives um, shows in their, um, the way that they treat other people. And um, we've been blessed to be recipients of that. Mm. And mm. you can be yourself. You know, and this is what's so wonderful, is that you can be natural, you can be yourself, you can feel comfortable to say what you want to say, and people won't get offended. Mm. And I think that's a beautiful part. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I felt my spirituality has definitely deepened during my, my time here. I, I feel a greater closeness to God, a greater understanding of his love um, for me, and... Um, for his children and yeah, a greater determination to even enhance that more. But it is no requirement to be a, a, of, of any faith to come and spend time here. It's just a beautiful nurturing environment that uh, with no pressure, but just enjoy. You know, it doesn't matter what religion we were, if we were Hindus or whatever, we felt that, you know, you would accept them as you've accepted us. And, and I think that's wonderful. Mm. You know, you you doing what God wants you to do is to love his children unconditionally and you feel that here. Yeah, I had a very dear friend of mine that passed away um, several years ago now and before she died she left a message with me which I think is a profound message in life and she said, Michelle, tell the people that the most important thing they can do in their life is to love one another, not judge each other and help each other through this difficult life. And this is a difficult life for many people and, and for most of us at different times in our lives. And I think that's what you feel is encompassed here at the Chilean Retreat, is that you know there's definitely love for each other, there's um, no judgment, and definitely help available to help you through your life. So it's been a great experience. We're, we'll be back. So we just like to express our gratitude yeah. very much for yeah. all the people that have, have impacted our lives this week. Yeah. Well, my gratitude is Michelle because she invited me. Oh, okay. Otherwise I wouldn't have known about it. And um, yeah. it has. It's been a highlight. Yep. I get emotional now. <laughs> <laughs> but um, it's been a highlight in my life. Mm -hmm.